Hey guys, welcome to Rotor Riot Rampage. This is our freestyle festival. We've got people out here from all over the country to shred some amazing spots and celebrate everything that is the FPV culture and lifestyle. We've got music, we've got graffiti, we've got ripping, of course. We had a paramotor show. We got people ripping around on dirt bikes, ATV. It's just all out chaos and anarchy. Let's check out what it is to be at this amazing event. Let's go. Like from where I'm at in Missouri, I'm a single pilot. Like there's not very many pilots out where I'm at. Coming out here was awesome. The junkyard's been amazing. Some everybody's been friendly and it's great for everybody to come together and be one, you know? Enjoy something we love together. This is the Rotor Riot 100 gate course. This is the biggest race course I've ever built. We got a quadruple dive gate, two double dive gates, and four regular dive gates, and then we've got 90 arch gates. It's gonna I'll be ridiculous. We are playing Z Tag. So Z Tag is laser tags for drones. It's really cool. So right now we're playing something called domination mode. Four pilots and each one starts off with a, with a different color. You have to convert everyone to your color by the end of the game. So we are using CNHL orange lipos. Thank you CNHL for sponsoring Rampage. These are the packs that I run and I absolutely love them. These charging packs are awesome. They brought out to the field here, so you can come here and charge and just fly all day. So if you're in the area, you better come down and check out the 100 gate track. The amount of charging cycles you can get in those batteries is just phenomenal. Let's set up the wing. Find me on the YouTubes. Show people right there. See that logo? That's me. And then I'm gonna sweep up that pole right there. I have to make sure I can barrel roll. I'll barrel roll over that line, that pole. I'll scoot back over to here.
You down? Done. That bitch is broken. He went out. He, he, he wasn't even near anything. He just, no, went he just went out. It's done, bro. Oh, people are flying over here. Like, we got flight lines for a reason. That's right there to the right, to the right. The camera? To the right. Oh, see, I've been getting good. I've been getting lucky, bro. In a designated area. Camera comes on. Bent props. These things broke. A little motor snip right there. But other than that, everything's in the top plate, but I have extras of those. Not bad you look all. like a happy man right I'm there. Really like oh, it broke the arm. Oh, so it was a little bit more. Well, it was a little bit more. And that's fine. That's still like, easy. Yeah, if I'm breaking this arm, like, you can't go wrong. That right there. I'm that's the only thing that y'all yeah. worry about. Well, I can't believe it was okay. Like, the whole time, Jeff's like, you sure you want to put it up? I'm like, yeah, I'm going to put it up. Flew one whole pack. It was beautiful. Forgot to press record. So then I had to wait for another flight, and then I'm like, all right, let me throw it up again, and that's where you screw up at. If I would've pressed record the first time, I would've made my flight, landed it, and would never put it back up for the weekend. Always press record. <laughs> So this is uh, Micro Mayhem. This is our uh, micro area. It's a freestyle setup. We got a bunch of LED light ropes to kind of guide you, and then all kinds of fun obstacles to fly around. Beta FPV sponsored this. Uh, they sent us eight of their uh, starter rigs. They are the Cetus, and uh, they're pretty slick. Excited about the film? Yes. Is this the first full-length feature documentary about FPV? I think so. This is something that's about a year and a half in the works. This has been something that really is just possible because we have an amazing community. Everyone is involved. I hope you guys enjoy it. I was feeling good last night, you know? Yeah. The Rotor Ride Rampage party out back. Yeah. <laughs> look how much fun they're having. Look at this, look, look. They just met each other two days ago. And this, look, look at this camaraderie. <laughs> Hey, Radio! Yo. Hey, Radio! Somebody actually has my shirt on. If your buddy gives you a shirt, you better wear the damn shirt. I'm a fan, I'm a <laughs> This is the OG. Find it anymore. That is like OG. You can't, that's how you wear it once. Original. Like that was my, I was like, oh my god, my logo is so dope. I gotta support the local homie. My man, man they definitely support. The local homie. Boom. Oh, this man's got, got stickers. I don't have them. Right. Rep your homies. If anything you realize from FPV, yeah. rep your homies. Yes, like, sir. that's it. I feel like I'm in, a, in, in a, like a, a dorm, man. Like, <laughs> yeah. Everybody, everybody's just hanging out. It's like we walk by. Hey, what's up? What's up? Hey, where you guys from? Where we from? New York? Where you guys from? Oh, we from Maryland. If anybody comes in a following year, for sure. If you think the Platinum Pass isn't worth it, it's worth it. I questioned it. I was very skeptical on the Platinum Pass and what we were getting, and if it was worth it. At the end of the day, I'd come do this next weekend. Hell, hell yeah, it's worth it. And then my expectations were like, oh, I'm gonna be stuck up. I don't, I won't recognize them, dude. Every one of them, every one of these pilots, everyone is helpful. Even the famous YouTubers are helpful. They're so nice. So this is the build room where everybody's building all their quads so they can go out there and break them again and then come back here and fix them and break them and fix them. You know how it goes. My best guess is interference. That's a flight controller. Because we'd like those filter sliders to be further to the right.
I am Totes McGoats, and this is Old Man Flux, my dad. <laughs> We're basically the only pilots in our whole town, so if you've ever flown alone, it's kind of, you know, there's nobody to push you, no one to, to, to talk about it with, nothing like that. It's nothing like having, being passionate about something and having nobody to talk to about it, so. Drew challenged me, or Drew challenged me to do a dive down the stacks, and I've never done a dive before, and I'm surprised it didn't, like, break at all. It's completely fine. Those of you that are ready to rip have a chance to win a new set of HDOs. Oh! You are going to do the Edwin trippy spin yes! up the tower. Who does it first? Shall take the goggles. Pilots ready. Ready. Thumbs up for good video. Okay, okay. Pilots, arm your quads. And trippy. And someone went straight for it. Dakota, oh my goodness. Oh goodness, someone's going up. Oh wait, he's about to get past. He just got past. It was a red trip, he's been right. Oh goodness, oh my god. Oh! 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 Wait. Detroit's very own. Woo! Woo! A whole bag of these HQ awesome. limited edition epic awesome. rampage colors. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thanks for That's trying. Awesome. Thanks for I appreciate it. Thank I know it was last minute rolled up. Just like, oh, you gotta risk destroying your quad. It's fun. It's, it's what you fun, expect. Riot right, right, Rampage. What else? I feel like this one's pretty special. It's been almost three years since we did a Rampage. So I just want to thank you guys for making this event possible. Yeah, yeah. We had some amazing sponsors that um, were really hand-picked. You know, first off, Rely On. Z-Tag and Fat Shark. That was a pretty awesome time. Gem Fan did something really special. These light up Rampage props. We had 300 made, and there's going to be none more after that. Beta FPV supplied us with some drones for the Micro Mayhem area. And uh, Ciotti did it up right. An amazing time. HQ and Ethics hooked us up with some very limited P3 props. There's usually only come in the PB and J, but we got some Rampage colors. Yeah! Toolkit RC hooked it up with some chargers. FPV Exchange, how could I forget? Such a critical thing to make this happen. FPV Exchange made the uh, COVID testing possible. This man had the most thankless job all day in the sun. Nevin stepped up and made this possible. So thank you, Nevin, so much. Drone Nation, that app, guys, that was pretty cool. They were able to set it up so we had some notifications even if you didn't have internet. So when you go back home, keep using the app. It can help you find your next new best pilot buddy. And I hope this weekend showed that flying with friends is all the more fun, right? Guys, give it up for our artists who made these amazing murals. <laughs> This is a 100% real carbon fiber faceplate for DJI goggles. I am not throwing this in the crowd. No. Animals, it's gotta be fair. Everyone got a dance off. Bro, dance off. Oh! 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 Thank you, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Uh, I wanna give a big shout out to our volunteers who busted their butts. Thank you so much. Stacy, come here. If you guys haven't met Stacy, I asked Stacy to help out with the rampage, and by the end of it, I was just helping her. This is her event. She made it possible, and she put it on for you guys. She loves this community so much. Thank you guys so much. Happy rampage. Enjoy tonight. You don't find a lot of people sometimes who fly drones. It's good to be able to hang out with people who are interested in the same thing. In the, in the FPV world, there's not another venue like this one. Seeing the people that you don't really see every day, you see them posting, seeing them in person, interacting, enjoying themselves in, in their own environment, really, it's pretty cool. You just gotta do it, you know? I missed out in 2018, and this year I finally, I was like, I'm gonna go big. Glad I came, you know, I got to meet some really amazing people. We all come together to be one, and it, it, it works and runs a lot smoother when we continue to act as one.